Yeah, I was very uh, satisfied and happy with with our full game effort, uh, especially on the defensive end. We, we've talked several times about how inconsistent we've been on the defensive end, uh, and, and we certainly came out with the right mindset. We knew what a good three-point shooting team UMass Lowell was, and, and uh, we came out, we did a good job taking away their threes, and, and we sustained that in the second half. I think that allowed us to get some stops, and it allowed us to play the, the way I envisioned us playing, which is getting up and down the court, um, playing fast in transition, um, playing unselfishly, driving and kicking, doing some different things that way, and I and I think our guys did a really good job of that in the low game. So we, you know, it was only our second time playing here at the rack, and and uh, obviously you, you you feel more comfortable shooting in the place that you play all the time and practice all the time. Uh, I was confident throughout that our, our we have good three point shooting. We have guys that can make them, uh, multiple guys, and and for them to come out and and make eight out of eleven in the first half. Uh, I, w I was happy to see our guys be able to do that and I think obviously we were able to sustain it and make four more in the second half and, and uh, it, it was good for our guys to gain some confidence and hopefully we can keep going uh, in the right direction with our, with our shooting. I think uh, we certainly didn't. We came out a little flat. Uh, I had changed the lineup a little bit for, for a variety of different reasons. Uh, but the f we were definitely flat. Those first, it was only, only took two minutes. They scored 10 points, and, and we didn't get off to a good start offensively either. Um, but we rallied after that. We, we, we sat the guys down and talked to them a little bit about their effort and then their energy level. We brought in some guys off the bench, and we certainly got that. And again, kind of like the low game, we got some stops. We were able to play fast in transition, got the lead, um, and were able to build upon that because we decided to, to play with that intensity in that disposition defensively. You know, Trevon is, is interesting. He, he Last year, he started out slow um, as a freshman. By about January, he figured it out, and he started to earn more and more playing time. I was really, really happy with, with um, his progress. Uh, he was probably our most improved player last year. Um, came this year, he, he had to battle some injuries. Um, things weren't going real smoothly for him. Uh, he battled through it. He struggled uh, in the first few games. Um, he had a, some really good practices the last few game, a uh, few days before uh, that Fordham game, uh, and he was locked in. You could tell, and, and it showed. Yeah, it was a wild second half you, to, to start on that. First of all, I don't think either team ran a play in that second half, and it was. I, I think we did some things to take away their offensive sets in the first half, um, and then they decided to spread us out and, and really try and attack us on their end end of things and, and they did a good job of scoring that way. And same with us, the way they play is so unique that you can't really run sets, you can't really run and try and get somebody the ball here and there. So it was really more about um, you know, Akeem and, and Martin, especially those two guys, playing a little bit of one on one to start creating for others and themselves and, and they were able to do that and Jerome obviously was the beneficiary a lot of that, um, getting the ball in good spots where he could do something with it. Uh, he also stepped out, hit some huge threes for us and got some good offensive rebounds as well. Uh, he's a talented kid, uh, we've seen that, we know what he's about, uh, he's a competitive kid uh, and he's going to help us uh, throughout the year, he's, he's been great. Yeah, Niagara is a tough team. You know, Coach Coach Casey does a great job with them. They, they've, uh, they've, they, he, he has started from scratch um, over the last few years, and you can see that he's kind of got his guys, the kind of guys that he wants. Uh, they're very athletic. Um, they have big wings. They have two explosive scores at the wing position. Um, they play physical defense where, again, they, they create some steals, they, they, they'll press a little bit, they'll change things up, play some zone, play some, some man. Uh, so it's going to be a challenge, especially, you know, you got to get on a flight, you know, you got to go up there and it's going to be cold up there in Niagara. So uh, it's going to be a challenge, but, but uh, hopefully our guys are up for it.